Hello there, Taurus. Thank you for stopping by for your weekly tarot forecast for February 9th through the 15th. I am using my Russian tarot of St. Petersburg once again. And so for Monday, you guys have the King of Coins in reverse, Taurus. King of Coins in reverse just means that on Monday, there's somebody that you've been being generous to. And on Monday, you're noticing that, you know what, they've kind of taken advantage of that. And you're calling that to a halt. The end of that generosity from you. So Tuesday, wow, how did this happen? Queen of Coins in reverse. Queen of Coins basically is a repeat of Monday. The King of Coins in reverse and the Queen of Coins in reverse both talk to me about generosity being shut off because you've been noticing some corruption here. So I'm not sure if you guys are having two different situations that are causing the same Thing, or if you guys actually have one person that you shut off the flow of generosity and then you kind of backed out of it and then you decided the next day, no, I'm really shutting it off. <laughs> but I feel like there's two different things and it may be that it's the same person but it's two different ways that they were taking advantage of you that you decide to shut off. First on Monday you shut off one thing that you're offering them and then on Tuesday you shut off the next thing. You're like, wait a second, this isn't working either. Thank you very much. So that's kind of a, a rough start to the week because it's always very disappointing when we've been generous to somebody and find out that they're taking advantage of that. So I'm sorry to see you guys going through that. Um, Wednesday, what we have coming up is we have the strength card in reverse for you. Wednesday, this just means that on Wednesday you're kind of beating yourself up. You're not really um, giving yourself credit for being the kind-hearted, wonderful person that you really are, Taurus. And you're kind of beating yourself up and blaming yourself for some situation in your life that, um, in all actuality, you probably didn't have that much control over. <laughs> so stop that. <laughs> doesn't pay to beat yourself up, but it never helps you. It never helps your neighbor. It never helps anybody else that you deal with. Don't do that. Just learn your lesson and move forward and don't make the same mistake again. It's all good. Beating yourself up is no better than letting somebody else beat you up. It just is terrible. I was going to say something else, but then I would have to say excuse my language. So I won't use that word on camera. <laughs> All right, so Thursday, what you guys have to us is the Seven of Coins in reverse. So this just means that you have a situation that you actually originated or began with the idea that there would be some kind of payout that would come back to you once this situation came into maturity. And so when the Seven of Coins comes up, this is telling me that that situation is getting close to being mature. It's getting close to being able to pay back out to you, but it's not there yet. So this is just some encouragement to be patient and to expect that that is coming even though you haven't seen it yet. Just know that it is still on the way. Okay, so Friday, Ace of Clubs for you Tauruses. This is really talking about major, major inspiration. And I feel like the inspiration that you're getting, it could come from watching nature, from seeing nature at work. Um, but a lot of times this kind of inspiration comes in from watching other people, seeing how they handle things, and just going, wow, that person handled that so much better than me. What can I do to imitate them and to handle my situations better? Um, so I see some inspiration coming in for you on Friday. I see you really having somebody demonstrate in front of you. This is the way you handle this. And I see you really learning from it, picking that up and going, wow, I can do that. <laughs> All right, and so then on Saturday, you have the Eight of Cups in Reverse. Eight of Cups in Reverse is an interesting card, Taurus. Eight of Cups in Reverse just talks about that you have a situation that before Saturday, you had looked at the situation and you had decided that for all the energy and the effort that you're pouring into this situation, you're not getting very much back in return. And that's a problem. You've decided this is a problem. And so you've decided to cut your losses and move forward. Walk away from this situation that's, that's not giving you anything back. It's just depleting you. Well, <laughs> when this card comes up on Saturday, this is telling me that that situation that you walked away from, guess what you're doing on Saturday? You're turning right back around and you're marching right back into it. Don't ask me why. I don't know why. <laughs> but that's what I see you doing on Saturday, Taurus. Now, Sunday, 
Three of Swords in Reverse. Looks like your decision of Saturday could be good because Three of Swords in Reverse is talking about getting some healing. So there's been some kind of injury to the heart that you're getting some healing from on Sunday. So sometimes that can come just through a good conversation with that person who um, did the injury. Sometimes um, it can come by just doing some action, taking some action to gain some closure. So there's a lot of different ways that healing can come into the heart, but I do see on Sunday that you get some kind of healing on an old situation that hurts your heart. Okay? So that is your week, Taurus. For those of you who would like to schedule a private session with me, please realize that I do more than psychic tarot. I also do mediumship as well as spiritual healing. So if you would like to schedule a reading with me, I would like it if you would check out my website first. I'm at amista.info, A-M-I-S-T-A dot I-N-F-O. Once you've poked around there a little bit, if you still feel like I'm the best person for you to work with, then get in touch with me and we'll schedule the session for you as quickly as possible. For everybody else, I will see you all here next week. Everyone have a great week. Peace out.